In a place where magic and reality coexisted, there lived a curious boy named Asher. Asher had an insatiable appetite for adventure and an even greater love for food. He lived in the quaint village of Eldoria, where cobblestone streets twisted and turned like the pages of an ancient book. Eldoria was known for its vibrant markets filled with the aromas of spices and the chatter of merchants from distant lands. Asher's best friend was a girl named Brian, who was just as adventurous but had a keen eye for detail. While Asher loved tasting new foods, Brian was fascinated by the stories behind them. One sunny morning, as they wandered through the bustling market, they stumbled upon a curious old man selling a dusty, leather-bound book. The old man noticed their interest and beckoned them closer. This book, he said, is a documentary of the world's most unique flavors and culinary techniques. It holds the secrets to preserving these traditions. Intrigued, Asher and Brian bought the book and hurried to Asher's home, a cozy cottage with a kitchen that smelled perpetually of freshly baked bread. They opened the book and found it filled with magical recipes and stories from different cultures around the world. The first recipe was from a distant land called Zephyria, known for its exotic spices and vibrant dishes. Asher and Brian decided to recreate the dish, a fragrant curry that required ingredients they had never heard of. They set off on a quest to find these ingredients, guided by the book's magical map. Their journey took them to the enchanted forests of Zephyria, where they met a wise old chef who taught them the importance of preserving culinary traditions. Food is not just sustenance, he said, it's the bridge to our past and the beacon for our future. Asher and Brian gathered the ingredients and returned to Eldoria. They cooked the curry, and the entire village gathered to taste it. The flavors were unlike anything they had ever experienced, and it brought the community closer together. Their next adventure took them to the icy peaks of Nordland, where they learned to make a traditional fish stew from the local fishermen. The villagers of Nordland were struggling to keep their culinary traditions alive due to the harsh climate and dwindling fish population. Asher and Brian realized the importance of their mission. They documented the recipes and techniques, ensuring that these traditions would not be forgotten. They shared their findings with the world, spreading awareness about the need to preserve culinary heritage. Their final adventure took them to the sun-soaked beaches of Tropica, where they learned to make a refreshing fruit salad from the local farmers. The people of Tropica were facing challenges due to climate change which threatened their crops. Asher and Brian not only documented the recipes but also helped the villagers find sustainable ways to grow their crops. They realized that preserving culinary traditions was not just about the food but also about the people and their way of life. The conflict in their journey was not just about finding the ingredients or learning the recipes but about understanding the deeper significance of these culinary traditions. They faced challenges, from harsh climates to dwindling resources, but their determination never wavered. In the end, Asher and Brian returned to Eldoria with a wealth of knowledge and a deeper appreciation for the world's culinary heritage. They shared their experiences with their village, inspiring others to cherish and preserve their own traditions. The book, Once Dusty and Forgotten, became a cherished treasure, passed down through generations. Asher and Brian's adventures taught them that food is more than just a meal, it's a story, a tradition, and a connection to our roots. And so, in the village of Eldoria, where magic and reality coexisted, the legacy of Asher and Brian lived on, reminding everyone of the importance of preserving the unique flavors and culinary techniques of different cultures around the world. The end.